this is the Raid X. You can get an idea about the size of the Raid X. That's a Glock 26 magazine on the right and a standard shot glass on the left. The thickness is just about the same thickness as the Glock magazine. Hooks on to your Picatinny rail there. You've got the uh, battery compartment here. This is a little window that you can pull down, shut the window off or up, and that'll give you a little indication of the status of your device based on turn it on and you can see the this air IR IR laser different power settings there and your battery indicator on the left hand side and that's off and if you just didn't want the light on at all you just shut it off there and this whole here is for your uh, tape switch. Um, the operation of the device, you've got your switches here. Basically everything from here down is viz. Everything from here up is uh, IR. And that's the fire button. And then you can increase and decrease the uh, sensitivity of your beam there on the front side. The beam sits right over the top of the bore, and we'll talk about that in a minute. Um, I like to put mine as far forward as I can, and here you'll see uh, it's pretty much even with the base of my light, and the uh, fire controls are within reach of my thumb uh, on both sides. You'll see the beam comes out pretty much the center there and sits right over the rail and that sits right over your bore. It's got some good advantages to that. Um, this is the RAID X. The RAID XE is coming out and is going to take the place of this. It'll be the newer model for this thing. But uh, a really awesome piece of gear. 